Hi everyone. So it's been my first day back at uni today since before Christmas. So I had quite a long day, but it's quite quite good to go back. So today I am preparing this, but without without the prawns. Mm -hmm. So I'm not sure what it'll taste like, but it's been quite well, very quick to make. Well, actually. I was telling Mum today that you get a little seasoning pack, guys, and Mum was like, oh, I think you need to put salt and pepper in. She put some salt in and now it tastes a little bit salty. Mm, well, but when, when the pasta's mixed in, I'm sure it'll be fine. Yeah. So this is what it's looking like. And the, the link, smell of pasta. The tagliatelle. Don't you? Like the smell right. of Please watch your hair, Ellen. Mom, I keep thinking she's going to set fire to her hair. hair. You get too close. Done quite a bit of work today, haven't you? Yeah. All the washing up. Very helpful. And Lucas went back to uni today. Well, he's not actually going to uni, he's gone back. To his flat. Yeah. It's the finished dish, it does look nice. Also, guys, I've, made, I've put a tea pudding in. What did um, you put in it? What's it called? Um, Cacao powder, vanilla. It doesn't look appetising, but it does actually. You're waving taste. it around. So is it set? Did you yeah, use your hazelnut milk? No, I use coconut milk. Coconut milk, right. Okay. Good morning, guys. Sorry we've not vlogged for a while. Just been really busy. Look how frosty it is this morning. I won't show you the dogs doing the business, but it's really cold, minus one. Apparently a lot of places have got snow. Comment down below if you've got snow. We want snow. Don't we, Eleanor? Betty. Betty's trying to get out. Betty, no! Straight over to the food. She comes out of Eleanor's room in the morning and she just sits there and looks at me and then she lets me like put my nose right up to her, don't you, Betty? She's got this little bald patch near her eye. I'm not sure if the hair will grow there or not. I've not had cats before, so I don't know these things. Hello, Betty. Hello, gorgeous. She's getting some like ginger bits coming through too, I think. Yeah, um, one of the brothers were full of ginger. Yeah. And her mum was like half ginger, half white, half mm. black. No, well, not half of everything. <laughs> oh, good. Hello. Fed. Got to start the day with a cup of tea. It's a must. I can't start getting going until I've had my tea. Some juice for Eleanor as well. And a bit of toast. And then when we've had that, we'll start get, getting on with our day. So for breakfast, Eleanor is having some of her homemade vegan banana bread that she made yesterday. She's put it in the microwave to warm it up and it smells delicious. I tried a piece of it last night and it is really, really Please nice. She don't want me to show her face because she's not done her hair or anything yet. So when we've had that, we'll be doing our plan. We have a plan for the day. Okay. So Ellen's been working hard this morning and I've been doing my work as well. What we tend to do in the morning is have a discussion about what she wants to do, what she wants to find out about. Um, we make a plan for the day. And it's just our lunch break now, so we haven't got much in. We're popping to the shop to get some bread and bits and bobs. And I also need to pop to the post office and we'll be doing some more work. And just, just doing this little video because some people said they'd like a sort of typical day, the things that we do. It's quite boring really, but I thought we'd share it with you. So guys, I have just made a really nice lemon, well I've not tried it so I don't know if it's really nice, but a lemon vegan jizzle cake with lemon nuts. So what are we having? We're having stew for tea, aren't we? Yep. I made the tacos yesterday. I'm not having them. Is it not vegetarian? You said they were vegan. Well they are, I'll show you. Uh, mm -hmm. What's this? I'm, I'm pretty sure it is vegan. I didn't think it was. Let me have a look. Well, it's just vegetable. Let me have a look, please. <laughs> I can't even see the ingredients on here. It's, it's just vegetable oil. 
Where does it say it? No animal products. Oh, okay. So you just mix it with flour and you mix. So this is the mixture for the stew that I've done so far. I've put uh, carrots, some celery, apple potato, uh, some butternut, not butternut squash, sweet potato, a um, little bit of spring greens. I think that's it. And then I put, oh, celery, a bit of celery. Oh, she's, just, she's scratching it. Oh, she just did it on the same scratch. Oh, no. Um, yeah. A couple of bay leaves, salt and pepper, and then what I'm going to do is put some of this, um, the gravy granules, the, the olive, uh, what is it, onion. Can I show them? Yeah, so Evelyn wants to show you her lovely lemon cake. Mm -hmm. She's really into baking at the moment, aren't you? Yeah, vegan baking. Yeah. Just in case you don't know how to make dumplings, it's really easy, it's just... Uh, flour, a little bit of salt and suet. Then all you do is get a spoonful. Sorry with the camera guys. <laughs> <laughs> and then you just basically blob it in. Like so. And then we'll put the lid on the pan and in about 30 minutes <laughs> it'll all be ready. I got it. She's licking the plate where a lemon drizzle was. Is it nice? Yeah. The icing really good. Is that? So this is it finished and look how much the dumplings have puffed up. And it's a lovely, nice, warming, hearty stew. Just what you want on a lo uh, not a lovely, a freezing cold day. Always warms you up. So just having a sit down. So the dogs are fighting, play fighting. They get a little toy and they play tugger. It's their favourite game. It's Holly. actually. Oh, it's a cat Betty's. toy. Mm. Millie's, Millie's sat here on my knee, but the other two, they like to play tuggy with the cat toy. You can go out there, go on. <laughs> I think they're going now, apart from Mason. Sat there. Baby. A little bit stubborn, that one. I have to spray him then. Spray him with some water. Mason hates water. <laughs> It's an absolute battle to get him to have a bath, isn't it? The other yeah. girls just, they're but fine, the but Mason, no. Sometimes we just have to use a hose pipe and some shampoo in the summer, don't we? Yeah. But like, he's not happy. He's not happy. He's not happy, are you, Mason? No. Oh, here he comes because I've mentioned him. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Oh, you big lummox. <laughs> oh, it's a bit stinker. Anyway, I forgot to say I put red lentils in the stew because you need a bit of protein. Now we're not having any meat. Normally I would have put a bit of um, chicken or some corn in. But I thought I'd just do it with the red lentils. And they're quite good because you don't have to soak them overnight. Because you can get those stew packs but you do have to soak them overnight. And I always forget. So just to say, uh, something's been going on about the trolls and it's come out, surprise, surprise, that one of the big ones is Katrina. I'm sure you all know who I'm talking about. Um, hoping tomorrow to do a smug Sarah if we've got time. And Ellen has been busy doing some research today. Maybe she might want to share some things with you tomorrow, I don't know. Oh, and we've just booked to go and see, what is it, Eleanor? Beauty? Big beauty, Big beauty day, out. day out. Comment down below if any of you are going. So that's all for today, guys. Thanks for watching. Hope you've enjoyed and it's not been too boring for you. And make sure to give us a big thumbs up if you enjoyed it and subscribe. And hopefully see you tomorrow. Bye, guys. Bye.